How's it going everybody? So in this video, I am going to talk about how to get rid of ingrown hairs on your armpit. So before I get started, please subscribe um, to my channel if you haven't already. Please follow me on Instagram, DylanBerg999. Um, Lots of easy ways to get rid of ingrown hairs. One of them is to simply put warm water on the ingrown hair. After that, apply a warm washcloth over the ingrown hair. Um, then you can get some tweezers and then you can remove the entire hair. Great, great way to do this. Um, make sure you get the entire hair though and not half of it. Um, you need to get it at the base. So this is very, very important. Some people that um, get rid of it, they're only getting half of it and then this doesn't fix the issue. You need to get all of it. Um, and that's all that you need to do. The reason the warm water helps is because it helps to get the ingrown hair um, kind of in the air. So what I mean by this is it opens up the pores and it makes the ingrown hair easier to tweeze with the tweezers, easier to pluck with the tweezers. So that's why warm water is very, very important. It opens up the pores. Let's talk about how to prevent ingrown hairs now. When shaving, make sure that you use shaving cream. I don't know why so many people don't do this, but you need to make sure that you use shaving cream. Um, you will get ingrown hairs if you do not. Um, make sure you shave in the direction of um, the, the hair, this is very important. If the hair, like for, for my neck, the hair goes down, so I shave downwards. If you shave upwards and I have, um, I get ingrown hairs, so I shave downward. Um, um, make sure too that you're using a sharp razor. So many people are cheap and they use those cheap, cheap throwaway razors. Never use these, these are awful. But um, if you're using a regular razor, if it's getting dull, replace the blade because dull razors, not only will they cause ingrown hairs, they're also the ones that when you do cut yourself, that's the ones that cause the most pain and the most bleeding is from a dull razor, believe it or not. Next and last one is to make sure that you are exfoliating. Exfoliating gets rid of dead skins. It prevents bacteria and the dead skin from getting inside the pores and causing your ingrown hair. So make sure that you do that and you prevent that. And that's basically it, you guys. End of video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg999.